Hello, great people. It's Elsa Africa here again with another interesting and uh, amazing episode. Today, I have decided to take you guys to the palace of uh, Baba Wan. I mean, this is one of the best palaces in the whole of Gokitunja division. Yes. So, I'm going to be showing you guys what this palace looks like. I mean, I know that I might not have access inside, but then I'm going to watch a football match and then I just decided, okay, let me take you guys into this palace. The road to this palace, I mean, it's a hilly, hilly road. You're going to be climbing a hill for like, I mean, it's a distance of maybe four kilometers or five kilometers. And you are climbing. There isn't any level left. In one of my videos, I told you guys about this cam of mangoes. I mean, this is where most students used to feed. Maybe I didn't say that in that video, but this is where most of them used to feed. When you look around, I mean, when you look around, yeah, I mean, just take a look. It goes right down there. We have like, I think, more than 50 or almost, more than 50 or almost 60 mango trees here. And I mean, look at the landscape here. It's a very hilly one. And we are only hiking, 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 hiking. I mean, this is something we've been doing for quite a while. We've been doing this for quite a while. So it's nothing new to us. Yeah. Just that it's been a while. We haven't done something, something like this. But then, let's go. As I'll take you through, and I'll be showing you some of the, maybe some of the attractions. I mean, you know. The northwest region is like a, it's full of landscape very interesting very awesome landscapes when you take a look i mean just look at this look at this look 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 bro it's just made out of landscape when i get uh, uh, to the top of the hill you're gonna see some of the amazing landscapes here yeah let's go when you take a look you know that oh we left from right down there and right now we are here i mean this hill used to be called small london even up to now this how they still call it small london i don't know what made it to be called that way but then this was a nickname given by students yeah so since then that name has remained and i mean it's a very tough hill though know? even though it isn't long or the distance isn't that long yes but then that name still stands, bro. Look, look, look. Then now from here you can take a look like this is the this is the landscape we've got here. This is I mean Gokitunja is actually a valley, so it's surrounded by just hills. Now we look at that end, that's Bui Division, the hills you see. And to this other side you won't actually see. It's bordered by Oku, but then you can't see from here. Yeah. I mean, I've started sweating like. Oh. You can look, uh huh. That was it. We've not arrived at the top of small London yet. But soon we'll get there. When we get there, you see a small level line. For instance, we start hiking again. Yeah. Here we go. This is the top of small London. From here you can spot many places. Huh? You can spot so many places. Huh? People live here. People live here. I don't know if the sun out here is something else. Whoa. This is the consequences of trying to use shortcuts in the village. I mean, like, this road was really bushy. Even though this road is, I mean, this is a very big road. I mean, when I say big road, in the sense that people, most people use this road to commune. I mean, or to commute. Is it commute or commune? Uh, within the village, especially within the down part of the village and the upper side of it. So, the road has always been like this, especially during the rainy season. Okay. And this road now can actually bike scan pass through this road or a car i think a car can pass through so it's an easy going it's a go 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 logging in my village okay so, who says people in the village are not enjoying hmm. 
chicken. Good. Not bad chicken. Mm. chicken. Mm. So, when you first have to follow up, then you have to do it. You think you can do it? Mm, 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 Living from where our house is situated in the village to the palace is always a very tough journey because you have to embark on this on food especially if you want to take a bike then you have to trek for a long while before you see where you're going to be taking a bike i mean and since we started this video it has only been hiking 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 there's actually nothing like a level land where you would say you will maybe rest for 10 20 minutes before continuing to hike except that you want to waste your time by sitting down to rest but then it's not the case here when you go to rome you do what the romans do so you trick the way they do it there if you're looking for where to do sports i mean villages in the northwest region of cameroon will actually help you do this you just go to the village and decide not to take any bikes because the only means of going around the villages i think is only bikes for now i think so bro look at this and the road is just somewhere here. This is funny. Hey! Look at my boy, I feel good there. Okay. You want to come out there? Other man, you're going to eat. Okay. Huh? It's a monitor machine. I tell you. Hey! Bro, look. Like, this is here. Right up here, I'm standing directly on top of this hook. I mean, I'm afraid standing here. Okay. Could just fall right down there. I'll be on it. But then we still have to You feel like 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 you feel you you this village has two sides. It has the down part, which is on a very level land, and then we have this other side where you need to only you are only hiking, hiking, hiking till you get to this side. So you can see houses behind. Don't just say, come here. You know, always it's easy to get to this. Most people prefer to use bikes and cars and stuff like that, but. We are taking the adventure by trekking. So where we live, you need to use all of these shortcuts so you can decide as where to go with your bike. It will be easy. Yeah. Since the crisis started, I have not been to this part of the village. I have not been to this part of the village. I'm coming here again just after how many weeks? I think seven or eight years. Yeah, and right now this is the main road now. We're just gonna follow this road till we get to the palace. It has a lot of potholes. I don't know how cars access this area. Hey. You got it. Look at this guy hiking with a bike. Bro, this is non bong bong, eh? When you see this, I mean, it's non bong bong. Okay? 
Yeah, this is people I was going with. I decided to take a bike when we arrived already. Sorry, I don't want to talk a lot here. Hmm? Just keep calm, go quietly. So the entrance to the village here to the palace is looking nice already. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I have a lot of people in front of you. So I just keep that fish. Hey, there's someone pulling on us. So many vibrant places here. Very, very vibrant. Yes, very vibrant. Oh. So many people here to play the football match. Eh? So. I myself, I came to win this and uh, let's just go catch up with the experience. Yeah. This is the entrance. So, this is what it looks like. Oh. This is the field, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And once you enter the palace, first thing first. I was putting on a face cap so uh, they always tell you to turn it behind it means you should wear it like the the, the face the, the front side of the cap should be facing your back yes that's how you should put it on that's the first thing and in the palace you don't just film anything or you don't just see many how you have some specification because at the african tradition needs to be preserved no I, I don't care what you think about that but then the tradition needs to be preserved and so when you get to the palace there are places you can enter with the camera there are places where you don't even dare enter with the camera and then this is the front view of the palace on your right there is a it's a grandstand and then here now is the front view of the palace and when we arrived the palace we had to go visit one of our grandmothers out here in the palace i mean most people some people in the village or because most people or some people actually have their roots directly from the palace or from their palaces so when we get here we always go with this our grandma and that's just it to tell her oh we came around and uh, nothing much more than this so this is like some kind of inside the palace do not actually into it that much yes and uh, I mean, I just love the the, 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 the the way these houses in the villages were always designed. Very simple designs and stuff like that. And I went to the palace to watch a football match like this is how much people turned out to watch this football match. I was treated, I was surprised that oh, so people could still come out like this to actually watch a football match. And at times it's raining, so when it's raining, everyone goes under the grandstand in the palace. I mean, to, to get shelter. This is actually the grandstand I was standing inside here. On normal days, you will not find chairs here, except there are probably some occasions in the village that find chairs. And this is where the funnel always sits in the palace no one climbs on this place nobody dares climbs here it's made only for the fun and it's actually you see no matter how far the sun is shining it's very difficult before the sun gets here because there is a colonel tree out actually there and this is the view of the grandstand the palace and the stuff here Finally, I got to the palace. This is where the phone was. We we'll always stand, and uh, if you had anything to tell the people. But then, since the grandstand is over there, I think that it was changed, maybe. Because, I mean, it's been long, I've not been here. I don't know, there's so many there. I don't know. I mean, it's a cool one. What do you think about this palace? What do you think about this place? I hope you are, you're loving it so far. I mean, this is one of the, oh, this is the best palace in the, I mean, well constructed. 
in the whole of the country and even in the northwest in the northwest as you say it's one of the best in the northwest so uh, the others which have so well but this is one of those best palaces and until then let's continue with the tour You tell my sister. Charlotte. I need question. I need it. Please, please. And everything is finally over here. I mean, we call it a day. Thank you so so much for having watched this video. I mean, if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Please consider subscribing. Do leave a comment on what you think, and please give this video a thumbs up. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. -bye.